Hi guys, uh, welcome back to HowMachineWorks.com. Today let's learn how a one-way restrictor valve actually works. So here we have a one-way restrictor valve. We're going to open it up and see how it actually works. This is the inlet side and uh, this is our outlet side. The function of the one-way restrictor is to create more flow in one direction and restrict the flow towards the other direction. So there will be a less restriction more flow in the forward direction and lesser flow in the reverse direction. Let's open it up and see how it exactly works. So we have a small valve unit, a small metallic unit which is inside uh, this which uh, facilitate this particular function. So let's see uh, how it does. So this is a unit that we have inside which is creating this one way restriction. You can see a cut section uh, inside here. We have a hole at the center okay and see there is a cut section here over here so when the uh, flow is going forward the valve rests like this so we have an opening in the side so the oil can come through here and escape through both the sides and get to the uh, center hole and also the flow can directly go through the center side center so we have three directions of flow one here one in the this side and one bottom so that's how more flow is coming in the forward but when uh, the return flow is coming so that I'll close it up the valve actually goes back like this here and when I close it uh, you can see the return flow comes like this when the return flow comes like this we only have this center hole uh, to create the flow because uh, this uh, particular unit has a play inside so it goes back and rusts like this so there is no sideways opening when it rusts inside the valve. So we'll have only the center opening which can create the flow. So on the return line we'll have less flow and on the forward direction we'll have more flow. And this valve has a small play inside the unit. I will show it how actually it happens. So you can hear the sound. So that sound is the movement of the valve inside. So when the flow is going towards the front, the valve will rust here on the top like this. Here, here it will rust on the top. So we have three directions of flow. One here, one here and one here. So we'll have more flow uh, in the forward side. And when the reverse flow comes, the valve goes back and rusts here. So we'll have only one direction, one apart. To facilitate the flow so we'll have less flow in the return so that's how a one-way restriction is happening uh, in this one-way restriction valve this is uh, used for hydraulic ramps etc for that the forward motion can be fast and the reverse motion can be uh, reduced that means the damping effect can be created so that's how a one-way restrictor works so uh, if you like this video please uh, click the like button or do drop a comment to motivate our team for more video updates please click the subscribe button and uh, uh, more updates will be coming to your inbox. Thanks for watching this video. Have a great day.